a man is right to pursue freedom and happiness. Sounds like a movie quote. A movie quote? Is that the one that old Will Smith played in? So you understand, if you don't identify yourself, you're going to sit in jail until you do, right? That's fine. Okay. All right, you and I have nothing else to discuss, okay? Okay. I won't be making a claim against your bond. You and I okay. have nothing else to discuss. Okay. Welcome back to the Van Balian channel guys. Today we head to Calhoun County, Arkansas for a traffic stop video where a self-proclaimed American national gets pulled over by an Arkansas state trooper. And let's just say this trooper has absolutely no time for this sovereign citizen nonsense, knows exactly how to shut them down and troll the scripts they use. Right, let's get into the video. Is the window light roll down? There it goes. Close. Yeah, well, that one won't. Yes, sir. How you I doing today? Hey, what's up, man? Got your flyer to take police from stop you. Weren't wearing your seatbelt when you come by me? Yes, sir. I, was, I had it. It's over my shoulder. That's what I was adjusting this thing here, sir. You didn't. Listen, you didn't have it on when you come by me, okay? Also, you have a brake light out on the driver's side. Yes, sir. And then your tag has a thing around it that obscures where your state stuff is. You can't even see your tag. Okay, it's Illinois. Okay. Do you have your driver's license, please? No, sir, I don't. Do you have a license? Yes, sir, I do. I'm Where's the out at? I'm a U.S. state national, sir. God, no. But my students are bad here. They wear me out. Yeah, you're a what? I'm a state national, sir. Where are you from? I'm from Louisiana. You have a Louisiana driver's license? Yes, sir. What, I did. What do you have now? I have a United States state national. Okay, there is no United States national. Either you have a license for a state that you reside in, yes, sir. or you do not. So which one is it? I'm not answering your questions, sir. You're not going to answer my questions? Okay. Now this is exactly why you shouldn't play stupid games like this with Arkansas State Troopers because they hand out stupid prizes like this. We're not bad for me. Come on back here. I'm not asking, I'm telling you. Come on back here. No need to be ugly. Sir. I'm not, not being, being ugly. ugly. But we're beyond the whole asking and being nice. Okay, Come on back right. here. Turn around, put your hands on the car for me. I'm under arrest. Step back, spread your feet. Am I under arrest? You are. Spread your feet. For what, sir? No driver's license, no seat belt. Okay. For your tag being obscured and for your busted life. Let's see him. I didn't know you can go to jail for traffic violation. You can go to jail for anything in the United States, man. You should know that. You're national, remember? Two minutes. Two minutes, guys. That's how long it took for this trooper to get this guy into a pair of handcuffs, proving yet again that Arkansas is where the sovereign citizen script goes to die, and rightly so. Where are you from? Are you from Louisiana? Are you going to Mirandarize me, sir? For what? You haven't committed a felony. You don't get Mirandarized. Okay. Come on back here. If I do a custodial interrogation based on a felony, based and you a might felony. you might uh, incriminate yourself, then I would read you Miranda rights. But you're not being read, Miranda. So have a seat. Hold on. Who are you? Hold on. Leave it to a sovereign citizen to not only misunderstand the law but the arrest process as well. These guys never fail at failing, do they? You think your pockets gonna pull me cut? Me stick nose. Anything illegal on you or in that vehicle? Anything illegal on you or in that vehicle? Let's see, Paul. You don't have to answer my question. We're done talking. Speed in. Hi. Do you have your ID with you? Hi, right, puppy. Does he have a driver's license? I think he does. From where? It would be Louisiana, I'm sure. Well, why has he got to act that way? Honey, I have. I'm 
sorry. I'm from uh, You can call me, honey. It's all good. We're oh. from the South. We do that, too. <laughs> I've been in the South for a What's while. What's up, man? You have an ID with you? Hey, can you talk to me? Can I say it? Report. I'm asking. I'm just asking if I can say it. I don't have it on me, no. That's fine. What's your name? Do you mind me asking? Uh, if you tell me why. Because I want to. Because I want to ask. Because it's my right to ask. It is your right to say no. You're 100% right. Well, at least one person in the vehicle knows their Fourth Amendment rights. Unlike the guy in handcuffs, that's something, I guess. Nice to meet you, though. My name's Jimmy. It is. Is yours? I already know my answer. Yeah. It's right there. Okay. And then, well, that's my... Is this register. your car? Yes. Where are y'all from? I'm from Illinois. What brings you down here? My friend Patsy lives down here. Okay. You know the Stricklands? I do not. Charles and... Okay. No, I do not. What's his name? His name? No, no. The guy having I don't care about him. He don't want to talk to me. You don't have to. That's his constitutional right. Is he not tell, talking no, to me? No, he don't want to talk to me. Neither one of them? So he's going to sit in jail until he tells me who he is. Mm. Welcome to Calhoun County. That groan says it all, really, doesn't it? That must be what it's like to live with a sovereign citizen 24-7. I bet she does that a lot. All right, we'll make sure your license is valid. If it's valid, we're going to let you drive the car and you can be on your way. Be right back with you. Did you take an oath of office? What? Did you take an oath of office, sir? I did. You swore to obey the Constitution? I swear to uphold the Constitution of the United States and uphold the state of Arkansas laws, which you are violating right now. Are you aware of what the fourth constitutional law is? What is it? Won't you educate me? Since you seem to know all your rights. A man is right to pursue freedom and happiness. Sounds like a movie quote. A movie quote? Is that the one that old Will Smith played in? Wait, so not only did this trooper have this guy in a pair of handcuffs in around two minutes, he's now trolling him like a Van Balian subscriber trolls soft sits in my comment section. Next he'll be telling him to sit in the back seat and keep his mouth shut every time he says something stupid. Man, come on, man. Man, come right on, man. Don't give me that crap. Long. You know what you're doing is wrong. And, oh, and yet here you are. Really? Here you okay. are. I just asked you a question if you took it up. This is the Fourth Amendment. Let violation. me ask you a question. You gonna tell me your name? Nope. So you understand if you don't identify That's yourself, fine. you're gonna sit in jail until you do, right? That's fine. Okay. All right, you and I have nothing else to discuss, okay? Okay. I won't be making a claim against your bond. You and I okay. have nothing else to discuss. Okay. A few moments later. So what's your reasonable, articulate suspicion that I'm committing crime? You and I have nothing to discuss. You can sit back here and keep your mouth shut. And he does just that for a few minutes, but the urge to spew the sovereign citizen garbage that got him into this predicament in the first place is too overwhelming. The use of emergency lighting in a non-emergency situation Why are you talking? is a felony, sir. Why are you talking? I'm warning you. You and I have nothing to say. Okay. Sit in the back seat and keep your mouth shut. Right, so now the trooper finishes up with the owner of the vehicle, they discuss non soft sit related stuff about her license for a couple of minutes, which I'm going to skip. So let's pick this back up where he lets her know why it's not a good idea to let someone who is unlicensed, like a soft sit, to drive your vehicle, and why the self-proclaimed American national is going to jail. Alright, now, I don't know if he has a license or not since he won't talk to me, okay, once I find out who he is. And if he doesn't have a license, if he's caught driving again, I'm going to tow your car. You understand oh, that? my car. It's your car, isn't it? Yes, sir. Okay. So if he doesn't have a license and he's driving your car, so I'm going to tow your car. If you give him, if he gives you his name. It's not helping him today. He's going to jail regardless. Okay. But I will know who he is this afternoon. So if he does not have a license and he's caught driving your car. Well, your he car, ain't driving my car no more. I don't know if he... You know. I'm just letting you know. Okay. All right. Not only, like, not only will your car be towed, but you'll be issued a citation for allowing him to drive. You see what I'm saying? Well, not right. that so I don't know let, if he doesn't have a don't license. Don't let him drive. It's your responsibility to know who, who has a license if you're driving your car. Okay. All right. So 
the I best way to if you look at my I'm note. not writing you one today. All right. Okay. But just to alleviate any issues, if you don't know if they got a license, don't let them drive your car. Because they're not going to be covered under your insurance. You have a wreck, you're, you're responsible for it, not them. All right. Thank you. He'll be at Calhoun County Sheriff's Office. He'll get out at some point. Probably won't be today. He's Where adamant he that? don't want to talk. Where is that? In Hampton, down by the Dollar General. Oh. Just turn left by the Dollar General, take that half oh, mile I road can't down get there. Him out. I don't have enough money. He ain't getting out today anymore. He don't want to talk, he don't want to cooperate, he's going to sit there until he tells me who he is or I find out who he is. So. All right. Appreciate you. All right. You're welcome. All right, man. Lean this way for me. Easy, my passion, Mr. Westbrook. Lean this way for me. Get your seatbelt, bro. So, won't nothing happen to you? Thanks. Yep. 1098, 1015 times 1. I not seen the Calvin County Sheriff's Office with a sovereign citizen for identification purposes. 10 4 And there we have it guys, another Sovereign Citizen plays stupid games with a no-nonsense Arkansas State Trooper and wins stupid prizes. So according to the original video description there was no incident report with this video so we don't know the exact charges. But let's hope he learned his lesson. It's doubtful because he's gone down the American National Road which means that this vehicle will likely end up being fitted with one of those Arkansas American State National plates at some point. Right, thank you so much for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video then please leave me a like, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you also to my channel members and patrons for your continued support. I really appreciate it. Right, take care all and I will catch up with you in the next video.